everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're looking at a mobile connectivity solution designed for high performance and mission critical environments, the Peplink Max BR2 Pro 5G router. If you work from a vehicle, a remote site, or manage infrastructure that can't afford to lose connection, this device is worth a closer look. But before we dive in, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. The Max BR2 Pro is a dual 5G Wi-Fi 6 router built for connectivity in mobile and remote environments. Whether it's a fleet vehicle, temporary command center, or a backup system for critical infrastructure, the BR2 Pro is built to keep data flowing. It's part of Peplink's mobile lineup and offers a wide range of WAN and LAN options, redundant SIM capabilities, and flexible power options. Here's what makes the BR2 Pro different from a typical mobile router. Dual 5G modems let you connect to two carriers at once, so you can balance traffic or fail over automatically if one network drops. It's equipped with Wi-Fi 6, supporting dual-band 2x2 MU MIMO, which can help increase capacity and performance for wireless users in the area. The router also supports Peplink's Speed Fusion technology with a Prime Care subscription, which allows for bonding multiple WANs together and maintaining session continuity during failovers, something that can be especially useful in live broadcast, telehealth, or mobile office environments. And for SIM management, it goes beyond just physical cards. You've got redundant SIM slots, built-in eSIM, and compatibility with Peplink's remote SIM injector and Fusion SIM. Now let's take a look at the device itself. On the front, you've got four LAN ports and two WAN ports. Inside the unit are two 5G modems, each with dual SIM slots. There's a serial port for out-of-band management, a USB 3.0 port can be used for WAN tethering with a USB modem or connecting accessories. Power input comes via a standard DC barrel jack, and there's ignition sensing built in so the router can start up and shut down with your vehicle. Around the side, you'll find eight SMA connectors for cellular antennas and two RPSMA connectors for Wi-Fi antennas. There's also a GPS antenna connector and an access panel for the redundant SIM slots, making it easy to switch SIMs without opening the whole unit. The BR2 Pro is built with installation flexibility in mind. It's also ruggedized for harsh environments with an operating temperature range from negative 40 degrees to 149 degrees Fahrenheit and certifications for use in vehicles, rail systems, and other industrial settings. Here's a quick rundown of the performance specs. Up to 4.1 Gbps download, 900 Mbps upload on 5G. 1 Gbps router throughput, up to 400 Mbps speed fusion VPN throughput, unencrypted. Supports up to 150 users, compatible with AT&T, T-Mobile, Verizon, and FirstNet in North America and offers connectivity over Ethernet, Wi-Fi WAN, USB WAN, and of course, cellular. You can even add a third 5G connection using the Peplink Max adapter via USB. The BR2 Pro is built for teams and organizations that need stable internet in situations where failure isn't an option. That could include public safety vehicles, remote construction sites, mobile health clinics, or any scenario where multiple carriers and automatic failover are required. That's a full look at the Peplink Max BR2 Pro 5G router. Looking to add even more redundancy to your connectivity setup? Visit our site to learn about our multi-carrier SIM. It gives your devices access to all three major US networks on a single SIM card and automatically connects to the strongest available signal. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.